everyone. This is Certain Structure Ron. Now, this time of the year, I'm going to come to you about safety. Please like and subscribe, and I'll keep bringing you these videos. So, let's just get right into it. Every year, thousands of people get injured with fireworks and the 4th of July burns some people do really stupid stuff I saw one guy one year that decided to kind of de-pants himself and well lay some rockets or whatever on his crack just really not smart little too much alcohol but people do it every year and so you need to be cautious and safe in what's going on around what's going on around you and what that means is that you need to be responsible for your own safety I would say get clothing that's going to be as non-flammable as you have. I would probably say that it would be best if you had a longer sleeve shirt to prevent burns. You might even, if it's going to be hot, get the shirt wet, soak it, whatever. Pants too. I don't know. Have fun. But people get burnt every year go to the hospital with serious burns and injuries some of its just stupidity some of its people tripping some of its people running away from fireworks as an item just all kinds of things you need to think about these things and be safe I would tell you for your home make sure you have a water hose in the front back whatever uh, make sure that they're working make sure if your house catches on fire because of a rocket or whatever coming over you know you uh, can at least fight a fire get a fire extinguisher uh, that would be a good one so in case something comes in through the window uh, I don't know there's many many things that, that can seriously go wrong think about things Make sure you have a plan if your house catches on fire. Just make sure. I've got several fire extinguishers around here. I live in the country. It's a volunteer fire department, which means it takes time. I've had to go out and work fires and take them to the fire because of a 911 address that they've responded to rather than the fire itself. So you need to make sure that you have a plan and that some of these small fire departments in rural areas where people just go, well, I won't say the word, but we'll just say they go uh, crazy with fireworks. You need to have a plan to put that fire out. Because if it's a 4th of July and it's a volunteer fire department, it, they may take a little while to get there. So, in any case, I'm just giving you a heads up. Please like and subscribe. And, uh, well, have a safe 4th. Thank you.